morning y'all and welcome to a productivity vlog meaning we're doing all things on the productive spectrum okay and i think a big misconception with like having a productive day is being busy and constantly just doing task after task after task my definition of productivity is doing the things that you've been avoiding <laughs> so that's what we're gonna do today i hope this can just encourage somebody who's been trying to put things off to put it back on and get it done we're gonna do it together don't feel like you're alone baby we're gonna struggle together and the first struggle is getting to the gym but guess what i put on i put on my gym outfit and that's the first step i think the first step is putting on them clothes girl because once the clothes are on ain't no going back okay don't sit on that couch get up and we're going to the gym so i hope you enjoyed this video and if you want more like it make sure to let me know in the comments below so we're gonna head to the gym get this workout on and then we're gonna come back home and tackle all the tasks we've been avoiding let's get into it Thank you Newegg for being our sponsor of the day. Newegg is an online site that has a variety of products from fitness equipment, apparel, electronics, home goods, and more. Today, Newegg sent me this massage gun. I love using this massage gun to loosen out my tight muscles before or after my workouts. This massage gun has five adjustable intensity levels. The massage gun has an intelligent charging display, an intelligent intensity adjustment, which means when you press the button harder, the intensity accelerates. And it also has five interchangeable massage heads so it can be personalized to you. This massage gun is also ultra light and portable weighing only 2.2 pounds i checked out several products on new egg site and the platform was super fast and convenient to use hit the link in my description to shop with a wide variety of new eggs products today trust me you do not want to miss out on all the amazing offers they are currently having so again click the link in my description and make sure to shop with new egg today Besides the part where I was doing my set, very much getting into it, and this old man comes up to me, and I know he was trying to be nice and try to be funny, but like, don't interrupt me during my set. <laughs> I like heard him, but I have I make sure to wear big old headphones to the gym. Like, please, this is a no talking zone. And this old man was like, remind me not to mess with you. But like, I was so in the mode, like I get aggressive, like when I'm like working out. So like, my face was like. RBF and I feel bad because I'm watching the video back because I literally got it on video and he was like all happy he's like remind me not to fool with you and I'm like doing my set in my face <laughs> but don't interrupt me during my set like I'm going in <laughs> anyways y'all we got it done we got it done because as I was in the gym you were supposed to be in the gym too girl like there's something about a workout that nothing tops like a good work out the endorphins are on a high right now i feel so good i gave my body exactly what it needs i tell y'all all the time our bodies 
literally need movement even if it's literally going on a walk girl you don't even have to do a whole elaborate workout go on a walk child swim do something that gets your body moving and feeling good and just a little sweat so i've been procrastinating on bringing back my wi-fi box for my old apartment to xfinity so i'm about to do that right now <laughs> so if you got any returns to make we're doing that right now so go get your returns bundle them up and bring them to wherever you need to bring them so i'm gonna go and return that and then we'll get home and it's time to tackle some big tasks we've got some cleaning and organizing to do we've got some meals to make and just things that are going to very much get us together i also want to show y'all some of my books that i'm reading that have really 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 helped me and changed my life my dual little bible study it's gonna be a lot Okay, so I'm gonna go return this and I'll meet y'all back at home. Okay y'all, so just got home and now it's time to tackle all the things I've been avoiding. Um, I have a list of everything I wanna get accomplished today. Number one being to get our new mattress onto our bed. Javon and I recently got a beautiful, amazing, bomb new mattress and we have yet to put it on. When literally all it is is taking it out the box and putting it on the bed. You see, like sometimes we be overthinking our tasks and then we actually do them and we're like, it's not that bad. So come on, baby girl, write it down. We gonna get it done together. So we're gonna do the mattress. We're gonna go upstairs, put some furniture together, get our media room together. I wanna show you guys the books I've been reading. We're going to make some dinner and then we're gonna plan out some stuff for next week. So everything is going to get done today. <sighs> Drink your water in the process. Literally, for real, get you a big old water bottle. I got this from Ross. I think it was like probably $15. Best $15 I've ever spent. Four of these a day will get you right. So let's go ahead and put this mattress together. All right, so I'm just unboxing everything. This is actually a promo I have to do. So if y'all see some of the same footage in a later video, mind your biz. <laughs> but let me see, okay. Ooh, they sent us pillows, baby. Feel these. Catch. Oh! Uh, yeah, I was an athlete later. Don't play with me. I definitely know how to catch. How? anyway, so. Okay, baby, here's how it looks. It's like a rolled up. All right, flip it up. Usually they got handles. Yeah, not in this case. I feel like they don't feel no different. When you lay down, you're gonna see. hours for it to actually inflate inflate but shoot it feel comfortable child i got my baby on this why you got my baby on this why you got my baby on this okay y'all so big task number one done and oh, now head. Now we go upstairs. I'm now in the room. I've been dreading. Okay, so we've got like all of our house together. If y'all don't know, we recently moved. So we have all of our house together besides one room. And I'm in that one room. And it's a lot. <laughs> Let me show you. It's just like, dang. It looks even worse on camera. Look at all these freaking boxes and the room is massive. <sighs> How are we gonna do this, y'all? I don't know, but I know that we are. So, let's start. <laughs> okay, we're actually about to start, but something just hit me because I'm just like looking at all of this mess and it seems so overwhelming and the easy thing to do would be to just like close the door, out of sight, out of mind, but I wouldn't be able to utilize this space if I did this. This space is my office space and I'm supposed to come up here, get my work done and have just peace and clarity. But with all this mess, I obviously can't do that. I know that's a reality for a lot of people. They have their homes, but their homes have been overtaken by mess and now they feel like they can't have peace in their home. They can't have comfort in their home. But let me tell you, when you take hold of your life when you take authority over your life again and you don't allow that mess to overpower you there is literally power in that like there is power in that there's power in saying listen i'm not gonna let this space 
take over my life. I'm gonna take my life and make it what I wanna make it. So I wanna make this space my office. This is supposed to be my office. It's supposed to be cute. I'm supposed to film videos in here, but there's so much PR and boxes and that I just feel like it's overwhelming. But we gonna take care of that today. I'm hyped now. Let me actually go get my iced coffee and then we gonna get into it. You better on the first day I should've said what's wrong in the first place I don't cause you always taking it the wrong way You won't listen, you're too busy playing 2K I've always been down but you still sleep And even though I said it now you should've been peed I feel it in my soul, yeah, it's so deep So deep, you should know that about me I just turned, just turned down your avenue I had to, but I'm mad at you Always say I got an attitude, oh yeah. But that's you, you was acting rude I had to ask you if you had a few Cause you always say I got an attitude, oh Why you talking to me like you be like Why you always wanna be right Oh, I just need the time that you can't find I just need to know that it's still mine and the way that you can't say my name don't seem right But I know when to go and to stop at the green light Oh, I just turned, just turned down your avenue I had to, but I'm mad at you, yeah You always say I got an attitude, oh Yeah, but that's you, you was acting who I had to What's up y'all? So Javon is still upstairs putting the desk together. And while he's doing that, I decided to come downstairs and cook. Listen, I know cooking can be something we procrastinate on, but I was just like, I'm gonna just get it done. And one of my favorite things to do is to just play a TV show while I'm cooking. Even if you can't like see your TV while you're cooking, just set up your phone, put some headphones in and cook and watch TV. I swear it goes by so much faster. So I'm about to watch Love is Blind season three, the season finale. I'm so freaking excited. And I'm about to cook us some salmon. One thing I love is a good piece of salmon. So I'm gonna cook us some salmon. I also wanna show you guys the book I'm currently reading. So this is the book I'm reading. It's When Women Pray by Bishop T.D. Jakes. Yeah. Let me just tell you, if you need guidance on prayer, if you want to understand the power of prayer, if you want to see women from the Bible implement prayer into their life and powerful things happen because of that, you need to read this book. I love reads that are just impactful on my life if i'm gonna read a book i need to get something out of it i'm not somebody who just likes to read so if i'm reading i really have purpose connected to it and this book is so amazing so i definitely encourage you guys to read i know it can be overwhelming especially because we have so much going on with our lives but my thing is before i go to bed i make sure to read one chapter one chapter this is like my new thing because it's so discouraging when I start a book and I just never finish it. I feel like a failure. I feel like I'm not capable, but I had to knock those thoughts out of my head. I was like, I'm gonna just finish the book. Sometimes we overthink it and then we end up not doing it. But I think taking little steps on a daily just feels so good. I also read this book called, I think it's like the 10 natural laws to success, or it's like the 10 natural laws to inner peace and fulfillment, something like that. And it talks about how you can have a day filled with tasks. I mean, you're doing this, you're doing that, you're doing everything. And then you come and wind down at the end of the night and you're like, I still feel so unfulfilled. And that's because you are not tending to any of your governing values. For example, some of my governing values are my relationship with God, family, working out. If I don't do one of those, on a daily, I'm still going to feel unfulfilled no matter how many things I checked off a to-do list. So my encouragement to you is to write down what truly matters to you and make sure you are tending to that on a daily. It doesn't have to be everything, but make sure you're getting up and praying if your relationship with God is a priority. Make sure you're spending quality time with your family if your family is a priority. Whatever that is to you, make sure you're doing it on a daily and you're going to feel so good at the end of the night because you actually did things that fulfill you. Anyways, 
let's go ahead and cook our dinner we're winding down for the night but i feel so good i got so much stuff done today and i hope you did too and i hope this vlog can just encourage you that you can do it mama i know you can <laughs> Okay, y'all just ate dinner it was so good like something really about a home cooked meal just hits different but i think that's gonna wrap it up for this video we got a lot done today and i honestly feel really great so i hope this video could help you and inspire you and encourage you that you can do it too girl i know life be hard i know we got a lot to do but it's just about time management and prioritizing the things that we need to get done so i love you i appreciate you god bless you and i'm gonna see you next Video. Mwah.